Good day! This is SmartwatchSpecifications.com, the premier set for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. Okay, we are back with a ZL54C smartwatch. An affordable, lightweight, wearable, equipped with a basic in sports, okay, fitness, and of course, health. Okay, so we have here the smartwatch, as you can see. It has a simple design. Okay, and with different features, especially in the sports function. So we are going to check the support app for this wearable. Okay, we will install and pair it with the support app. So if you have any questions regarding the app installation, okay, the support app installation, just drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries if we do have that time. Okay, so let's start and install the support app for the smartwatch. Okay, so it is included with this user manual. Okay, I'm not sure if what is the support app for this wearable. I think it's Daffit if I remember it correctly. But in the website, okay, that where we bought the smartwatch, it says Glory Fit. We'll see. Let's check. Okay. So let's go to the settings here. Let's see if there's a QR code for the smartwatch. Okay. So where's the settings? It's here. Oops. Go back. So we have here the settings. Is it available here? Phone on, power mode. It's not available in the section. Okay. How about the other menus? Let's see. Let's adjust first the menu here. Display, menu view. Let's go to the list section. It will be easy for us to identify the application. Okay. So let's look for the QR code, hopefully it is available here. Okay, alarm, cycle games, calculator. Seems like it's not. Okay, I'm not sure. Okay, anyways, let's just go to the user manual here. Let's check. Okay. As we go on with our ZL54C, if we notice the use, the QR code, we will let you know. Okay. So the user manual, it's available in English and okay, Chinese language. Where's the user manual? Where's the QR code? Now we have here the QR code. Okay. How about in English? Is it available? Okay, we have it here. Okay, so let's scan this QR code. There's no name on it. So I guess we really have to scan the QR code. Okay, so let's check. Okay. Okay, so it's the Affit application. As you can see here. Okay, so that's it. App. Go to website. Okay, let's see. So we are we are provided with a link. So it opens the Google Play Store, and we have this application. So we are very familiar with this app. Okay, it's a very easy to install application, and so far as you can see, it is very popular, and so far. Based on our experience, it is stable, okay? It has a stable connectivity with other smartwatches. Okay, so it's now downloading and it will also directly install the app in our 
smartphone. Okay? So, let's wait. Okay, it's now installed. And we have here the version 2.5.2. 13.6 MB. So, let's open the application. Okay? So, let's wait. As you can see here, we did not activate our Bluetooth. Okay, so we have here the profile. Okay. We just skip the profile and we are now on the dashboard. Okay, so here in the bottom part, we have some main menus. So this is for your steps, exercise records, and health. It's available here. On the second menu here, so we have here the settings for your device. And of course, the last one is the profile. So here, it is where you are going to pair okay, your smartwatch. Okay, it's where we are going to set our GL54C smartwatch. Okay, so earlier we checked on the smartwatch here if we, where we can find the QR code. Okay, it's, it is here in the settings. Okay, so it is in about, I think, yes, that's it. Then we have here the app download, as you can see. Okay, that's why... We forgot where it is located usually it's here on the main menu on the settings but it is located here in the bot section okay so let's start pairing our smartwatch okay so as you can see here you have not linked a device so let's tap on a device okay so here we have our first permission allow Daffy to access this device's location just allow it. And Daffit wants to turn on Bluetooth. Just allow the activation of your Bluetooth. Then we have here, right away, it spotted or it found our smartwatch, the ZL54C. Okay, so we have here the MAC address. So to make it sure, you can check it here. Okay, so it is, it is the same smartwatch as you can see. E8, the MAC address, EA. So, tap on it. And it's now connecting. Are we connected? Oh, yes. We are 100% connected. So, we have successfully paired our GL54C with the support app, Dafit application. Okay, let's go. With the prelim preliminary setup for the notifications. So let's set it. Okay, the phone and the messages. So we have here, it is asking for permission. Allow Daffit to send and view SMS. Allow Daffit to access your contacts. And so it is asking here for the security. So let's check. Seems like everything is okay. The phone, so activate the permission here. Okay, so check, 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 so everything is okay. Let's activate the WhatsApp application. Okay, enable. So we'll enable the notification permission for the application. Enable here, then allow. Okay, so it is activated. Go back. And as you can see here, it's already set. Facebook and Twitter. Okay, so everything works. Oh, everything is set oh, for the notification function. Okay, let's go here. For the other section and let's see. So we are set to 12 hour format time as you can see here. So we are set to the 12 hour format time. Do not disturb. Quick view is activated. Let's activate this one, the drink water reminder. Will not activate this one, the heart rate warning. Okay, so let's just activate it. Okay. So this is for the women. What else? Quick view is okay. Auto lock. Let's change it, let's make it 20. Battery saving, control for music, 
and reminders to move i also like this feature and let's set okay so seems like everything is set for our zl54c we can now re receive notifications as well as change other features or other settings for our smartwatch okay let's check for the upgrade so the latest os okay so that's it if you have any questions regarding this the video tutorial for the pairing of the zl54c with our support app dafit application just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if we do have that time bye